All right, everyone. Today, we're gonna be trying to row all the way to Guarma. So Guarma is an island in the Caribbean, far, far away from where most of the map where Red Dead Redemption 2 actually takes place. So basically what I wanna do is see if I can find it. So the only thing between us and Guarma is obviously gonna be a bunch of water. So we are gonna need to find a boat. And luckily we've got one at camp. I Let's go, Arthur. Wish me luck, gang. I'm probably gonna need it. Don't have that much food. So I've done my research. Guarma should be located somewhere below Rhodes, around right here. So I think the first thing I'm gonna try is just to row to that landmass down there. Right, and the rowing begins. What the, what the, Arthur, Arthur, what the, what is happening? Okay. Okay, great. That That's just amazing. My guy literally just jumped out of the boat. Jeez. The hell is wrong with your face? All right, I'm gonna try a different route this time and hopefully I don't sink. Come on, make it, make it. It's right there. Don't sink. Please don't sink. Oh God, no. <laughs> Look at the way my health cord just falls. Okay, the game doesn't like this clearly. Okay, so clearly since the game doesn't like it when I try to get out of the map, I'm gonna need to glitch my way out of the map. We're, we're gonna have to outsmart the game. So there is a way to do this. So instead of going in these two directions, I can instead go in this direction towards Manteca Falls. And then the goal from there is to get drunk and pass out and I should be glitched out of the map. At least that's what's supposed to happen. Got to avoid black water. They've got freaking invisible snipers out here. I'm not looking to be killed. So I'm gonna try to steer as clear as I can. Oh. God damn it. The invisible sniper did eventually get me. Screw this. I'm switching to John. <sighs> now the invisible sniper should not be a problem. Come on, John. See, the issue with John is he can't swim, so there's quite literally no margin for error if I accidentally sink this boat. Just do oh, see? Like that. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, see, the issue is I can't row too close to the coast, otherwise the game will punish me for that. Damn you, John, and your lack of swimming prowess. All right, nearly there now. Come on, come on. Oh, finally. Finally, my stupid boat didn't sink. Now, apparently I just need to come somewhere around here and just keep chugging alcohol until I pass out. Drink up, John. Oh, it, it happened. Right, I successfully glitched myself outside of the map. Now it's time for me to make my way along the coast here and find another boat. Then from there, I gotta make my way all the way up to here, just to the right of Van Horn. And in theory, if I just keep rowing from there, I should just make it all the way to Guarma. I think. I mean, so many things always don't go to plan, so who the heck knows what's gonna happen. Give me a boat, a canoe, something, anything that I can row. I don't wanna have to run all this way. Yes! Oh yes, good things do happen to people. We have a boat, so uh, let's just get in. Duh, Bruh. what the hell? Oh my God, it's a sun. It literally just sunk. That has got to be the biggest tease of all time. Hey, how are you gonna, why, are you, why do you do this to me, game? You're gonna give me a boat and then you're gonna sink it right in front of me. Oh God, you know what, fuck <laughs> this game. Oh, don't slip, no. Don't you dare. Swear to God, John, if you fall in the water, I will murder you. Oh, yes. 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 Okay, this one isn't sinking. Oh, thank you, God, so much. Okay, now I can actually properly start rowing again. This is our current position, so we're just under Braithwaite Manor. I'm just gonna row around Saint Denis and to Ansberg, like we planned. I'm just glad we <laughs> we found a freaking boat so I didn't have to keep running around the coast like a goddamn idiot. All right, so 
Uh, I pretty much made it to Ansberg. It's a little bit cloudy right now. Ooh, rainbow. Uh, it's a little bit cloudy right now, so you can't really see it. But basically from here, it's just gonna be a lot more rowing. My finger is so freaking dead. I've like been mashing the X button for legit two hours because I'm also rowing against the current like an idiot. Uh, there's like this secret sort of like body of water that just continues. And, and if I just keep following that straight, and tapping X for another few hours, I should make it to Guarma. So yeah, let's kill my finger. <laughs> Right, looks like the waves are getting a bit more not kind. Rowing against the current is so difficult. Dude, John's gonna be burning like 20 or 30,000 calories during this challenge. This is nuts. But slowly but surely, I am moving straight. What? What the? Yo, what the fuck? Whatever's happening, please stop. I broke the game. God, look at how far out of the map I am. Yeah, this is really... Okay, okay. Okay, I think the issue was I rode a little too far away from the coast and I hit like a digital pothole. Here we are again, I'm not gonna mess this crap up. Okay, so basically I've got to take a right here. I've got to come here. And this is what is called the under the map access point. And uh, what the? The sand, I'm s I'm sinking. What the hell is this? It's not a problem, just forward. Oh God, all right, I think I made it. Oh, all right. I have now sunk under the map. So from here, it's just um, a bunch more rowing in the Southern direction. God, this is some glitchy crap. <laughs> this is so freaking weird. I have no idea what Abigail all the way back at Beecher's Hope must think. All right, <sighs> we've made it. I finally made it to the Guarma map. Waves are super crazy here, so I gotta be careful. That's Guarma over there, so. And on the boat, oh, <laughs> god damn it. <laughs> the waves are so heavy. Oh, you see, there you go. I'm no longer under the map now. We just have to touch shore without dying, hopefully. Oh. All right, come on. Come on, come on. Come on, yes. All right, yes. Touchdown. Sean has made it all the way. Dude's probably burned like a hundred thousand or like a million calories or something. He should be dead. Yep, this is Guarma. Definitely confirmed. It's a lot of effort to get here, so is it worth it? Well, you get to kill pretty birds, so I would say yes. Look at that beautiful bird. 